Hey guys, so today I'm going to be filming you a summer skincare routine and I have um, like four things that um, you would normally do in your skincare routine but three of them are DIYs and I actually have like a notebook that like I planned um, like all the things that should be in the DIYs and like one of them isn't a DIY, one of them is just like a foaming cleanser by Avino but um, I have a cleanser, a scrub, a toner, and a moisturizer um, for summer. And like the moisturizer is like really moisturizing, like coconut oil, like that kind of stuff. Because I actually just got back from the beach and my skin is like super dry. So I wanted to, some, to do something of that sorts. And I have like a toner and a scrub with like sugar, lemon, cinnamon, all that good stuff. So without further ado, let's get into the video. For step number one, I'm just going to be cleansing my face with this Aveeno Clear Complexion Foaming Cleanser. And I'm just going to go ahead and, mo or not moisturize, um, cleanse my skin with this in a rubbing motions. And then I'm going to rinse and dry and then I'll be back. Okay. So for the scrub, we're going to be using, I don't know if you can see this, um, sugar, lemon, cinnamon, and nectar. Um, pretty much the nectar is organic agave <sighs> I'm like out of breath for some reason okay so I have my sugar sugar I have my lemon I have my cinnamon and I have my agave so first I'm just gonna cut this it's like sliced all weird but I'm gonna just cut this in half well not really in half because I'm gonna save more so I just cut that in half. So we're going to be using this side to like rub it onto our face. Um, but then we're going to make a mixture with a bowl. And I'm just going to eye it pretty much like there's no like um, specific measurements for this. I'm just going to put some sugar into this bowl. I don't know if you can see that. Oh, this smells so good. And then I just have some ground cinnamon that I'm going to put into that bowl. And the ground cinnamon will just help um, the blood flow in your face, which is good. And the sugar will exfoliate, and the ground cinnamon will also help exfoliate. Um, and then I'm just going to pour some agave into this, and this will help brighten your skin complexion. I'm just going to like eye it, and then if I'll just add some stuff if necessary and then that is what it looks like and I'm just gonna mix it up to see what the consistency is like like you don't want it to be too thick because you want the lemon to like the mixture to stick to the lemon but if it gets too thick from the agave then you could always just um, like take a scoop and rub it on your face and then take the lemon and rub it on your face I'm like spilling it everywhere. Okay. I'm just trying to like smush it down with a spoon. It smells really good. Okay. So, this is just what the mixture looks like. I'm just gonna wipe my hand off on that. Let's see if this will stick. Yeah, it sticks pretty well, actually. You just need to, like, get a clump on there. Like that. Then I'm just going to put my face over the sink. Oh. And start rubbing. I'm just going to grab some with my hand. And the lemon is really going to help brighten your skin and just make your skin look like it is glowing. And who doesn't want glowing skin? Let's be honest here. This is like chunky. It smells so good though. Okay. And I love how everything that I'm making is so natural and it's so good for your skin so yeah i'm just gonna keep on going until i get my whole face covered and then i will get back to you guys oh my god this is so cool 
I've never like done a scrub with like a lemon like this before. Like I know Michelle, I saw Michelle Fawn do one a while ago, but like, I don't know. I've just never done it. So yeah, I will keep doing this and then I will rinse my face and pat it dry. And then I will get back to you guys. All right guys, so the tea is done. And I just put both of the tea bags in because why not? So now I'm just gonna squeeze the tea out with my hands to get all the good juices out of there. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take a cotton pad and I'm just gonna like dump, dunk the whole thing in to get it all nice and saturated. And then I'm gonna squeeze it out. And I'm just gonna take this and I'm gonna rub this all over my face like I would a toner. This feels so good. Oh my god, this actually feels like amazing. And I can already tell a difference in my skin complexion from the lemon. And I can literally still smell it. Like, it smells so good. So I'm just gonna rub that down my neck, too. Oh that feels so good. Okay. So I guess you could repeat that as many times as you want, or you could just drink the green tea and be healthy. But yeah, so that is it for the toner. And now we have the moisturizer. So I'm just gonna let this dry and then I will start making the moisturizer. Okay, so now for the moisturizer, we're gonna be using three main ingredients. We're gonna be using um, organic coconut oil, olive oil, and then um, lavender essential oil. So I'm basically just going to spoon some of this coconut oil out. <laughs> Make a spoon. I'm just going to use this one. Okay. So just spoon some coconut oil out. I mean, you could just eye it, um, but if you want to use this moisturizer more than once, obviously you can use more of the ingredients, but I'm just putting like a medium amount in. And then, I'll put some olive oil in. And all these ingredients are super moisture, mo little moisturizing. I'm just gonna put some olive oil in. And then I'm going to squeeze some lavender oil in. It smells so good. You do like five drops yeah that's good okay <clears throat> so that is what it looks like and then I'm just gonna take the end of this the like the other side of the spoon and mash it around and mix it all up so I'm just gonna add a little bit more olive oil And mix that up and then what I'm gonna do and how I'm gonna apply it is I'm just gonna dip my finger in and then I'm gonna warm it up in my fingers like this and obviously this is extremely moisturizing um, I actually really need this because like I said I just came home from vacation and my face is extremely dry from being on the beach and like swimming in the ocean and the salt water and all that stuff so I definitely need this so I'm just warming that up in my hands again and it smells so good like all these all this stuff actually came out like better than I thought it would but then I'm just gonna rub some down my neck and I don't really know if I would recommend doing this before you put on makeup because your makeup will probably just slide right off. So I guess this would be better for a night routine. And obviously you wouldn't, you probably shouldn't do a scrub like every night before you go to bed because you, sh you could be ex over, exfoli uh, over exfoliating your skin if you do that. So I would just do this. Um, you could do obviously do like the toner and the cleanser and all that stuff um, every night. 
Um, but I just wouldn't do the scrub every night, like maybe a couple times a week. But this, my face feels so nice now and moisturized. So yeah, I'm just gonna keep massaging this into my face. And it feels so good. So I'm just gonna rinse off my hands. And I think that's it. That was actually really fun to make all this stuff. And I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video because my skin feels and looks 10 times better. My complexion looks better. My blemishes will hopefully be gone by tomorrow because the scrub just like brought them right to the head. I know that's kind of gross, but it did. Um, so yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching. And I know I promised you guys a DIY for like the end of summer because I am gonna be start be starting to do back to school videos. So yeah, this is my last summer video. Oh my god. I literally made a mess, but that's okay. So yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed and make sure to comment and subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. So yeah, I hope that you guys enjoy. Bye!